Certainly is wonderful to experience more daylight, even when it's cloudy outside on a day like today. I mean, we have clouds around right now, and in terms of holiday or Christmas decorations, you know, Light Fest is still going on right here in Wayne County. That is still always a wonderful sight to see, and certainly is still festive all the way through the new year, at least. Out there right now, we're looking at cloudy skies. The rain that we had overnight, which was heavy in some spots, is all gone. But colder air is replacing some of the milder air that we had just a few minutes ago, a few, a few hours ago, I should say. When I say milder, temperatures were in the 40s just after midnight. Now we've retreated into the 30s, and we stay in the low and middle 30s for the rest of our day. Mostly cloudy skies by noontime in this afternoon, with temperatures mostly around the freezing mark or just a bit below. 35 right now over at Metro Airport, even with temperatures above freezing, with a wind of now 23 miles per hour during the 6 o'clock hour, it feels like it's way below freezing. Feels like 23 when you step outside, so make sure you bundle up. Are you doing some traveling today on this Monday, third day of Kwanzaa? Well, 32 degrees out toward Grand Rapids, sunnier skies closer to Lake Michigan and Ludington as well, with 30 degrees. Farther north, though, from Gaylord into Traverse City and Alpena, cloudier skies with on and off snow showers for this morning especially. Better chance of snowy conditions throughout the UP. Mainly light to moderate snow that will fall, but temperatures in the single digits over in Ironwood and in the low 20s elsewhere, from Escanaba to Marquette and over to Sault Ste. Marie. Back closer to home. If you're staying in southeast Michigan, still a good place to be, of course. We're looking at cloudy skies right now and drier conditions this afternoon. Currently, it's 31 for our friends over in Lapeer, while it's 36 in Mount Clemens, 33 degrees over in Ann Arbor. And temperatures remain steady for the rest of the day. And those winds stay pretty strong as well, to the tune of 15 to 25 miles per hour, wind gusts around 30 to 40 miles per hour. So if you're in a truck or RV, make sure you have both hands on the wheel. Be careful navigating some of those curves. We're looking at 19 is the current wind chill over in Pontiac. So grab your hats, scarves, and gloves also, because it is uh, pretty windy out there and makes it feel a lot colder. But as you can see, later on tonight, we're looking at colder conditions because it clears out quite a bit. Quite a bit of sunshine for our Tuesday, that's great. But the rain, snow, not done with us wet yet. We have some rain and snow showers returning on Wednesday and some more for the start of the new year. So to round things up, temperatures in the low 30s for the rest of the day, starting at around uh, 9, 10 o'clock later on this morning. Teens overnight, grab an extra blanket, be careful with those space heaters. Some sunshine for tomorrow, a high of 31. Then clouds return with a rain-snow mix on Wednesday, a high though of 43. Some early snow on Thursday for New Year's Eve, but during the day it's going to be cloudy and mostly dry, a high around 36. Clouds remain overhead with temperatures in the upper 20s when we uh, ring in the new year. And for the first day of 2021 on Friday, Another rain snow mix early, but really turning into a rainy day, it turns out, for the first day of January as we ring in the new year. And for the first full weekend of 2021, drier, mostly cloudy, seasonable, highs in the middle 30s.